Adding the history of black people to them in America to school curriculums is a conversation that districts are having across the country right now. Denver Board School member Tay Anderson has been calling for it for the past few weeks. DPS says it's already working on those changes, and that's largely because of one school in the district. Nine News reporter Jordan Chavez spoke with the principal and a few students who did the legwork. It was our students and our history teachers of DMLK that brought forth this change. And this Under Principal happened. Kimberly Grayson's leadership, the change to integrate black history into school curriculums started with a trip in October to the National Museum of African American History and Culture in Washington, D.C. I learned much more than just slavery and Rosa Parks and Dr. King, because while those people they're very important and their their names and their voices, everything that they said and did should be known in history. There's it's so much deeper than them. You know, students like, like Savoy Rosa Proctor Parks learned the untaught parts history. of the civil rights movement, like, exactly while others like Kalia Yaizor got a deeper understanding like, of slavery. All of the labor of the slaves over 400 years amounted to like billions of dollars of economy money that I didn't know happened. Like I knew we played such a large part in the economy, but I had no idea. Like America was literally built on the back of built on the blacks of slaves. The students documented each detail they learned to teach their own history teachers who now advocate for the change. It should not be an additional class. It should be the class. But even in a district so diverse, it's surprising how much we don't know about our, know about our own history. Senior Alana Mitchell says the lessons are for all students to develop an understanding. I want them to learn everything, everything, including the good and the bad because the more that they know, the more that they can begin to try to understand. And outside of the public education system, these lessons can be pricey. They would have to pay like hundreds of dollars just to fly out to DC, just to get into the museum, just to walk around. But they must be learned. Otherwise, Principal Grayson says their education is incomplete. There is no history. In Denver. Without. Jordan Chavez. Black History. Nine News. And DPS board member Tay Anderson says he hopes the new curriculum will start in the fall of 2021. The students are also working on a podcast that will launch on the 4th of July. It's called No Justice, No Peace, the MLK Take. There will be eight episodes and they're asking for community feedback on what the final three episodes should feature. We'll be posting a link to that podcast in this article on 9news.com.